Welcome back. You are still watching Pandona Magazine right here on NBS Television, your two source. My name is Precious TM. And if you've just tuned in right now, it's time for you to find out what is making news and gossip. And of course, this time around, controversy is following Brendan Nambi of the duo HB Toxic over the song Party Started. Now, upcoming duo Smash and Caesar are claiming that Brenda could have stolen their song Party Started. But what is the real truth about this particular story? Now, Smash and Scissors happen to be in the Pandora studios. And of course, even though we don't have Brenda or Ali Alibai of Talent Africa physically in the Pandora studios, we're going to try during the show to see if we can get them via cell phone to tell us their side of the story. Watch. So what is the story? Is this true? Yeah. Okay, so tell us what exactly happened. How how did they get to your song? If you say it is your song, actually, uh, what I think the story is, um, the producer worked together with Brenda, cause the day we went to the studio. What's the name of the producer? The producer is called Nash. Um, the day we went to the studio uh, to do some project actually with him, so he did try to show us what new stuff he's got. Then he tried to look out on the new stuff. Then later on. He unleashed that song Brenda did with Big Chill and Mosh. So we listened to the song keenly. Then we gave it time. Then after we thought of it, uh, we, 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 never, we never brought out our reaction towards the song. Because Why? Because, no, had you done this song but it started with the same producer? With the same producer, mm -hmm. like Air Back. But it was written, like, actually five years back, but produced Air Back. But it wasn't, like, on release, like, so soon because we had planned like waiting for our breakthrough maybe, then we let it go, because it's an English song, and it was just set for an international art scene. So we were waiting, but shockingly, we got the sad news, mm. and we were broken, because of course it was not expected. After working f with someone for two years, then he betrays you just like that. Okay. Yeah. So after finding out that this is the song, it is your song, but it started. How did you, when you confronted the producer, what did he say? No, the producer was like, um, actually, he was like, um, at first when I met him in the studio, mm -hmm. he was like, um, Smash, I have something new. These days I'm working for Brenda, you understand, of HB Toxic. Then I was like, oh, okay, that's fine. Then he was like, um, I have some new videos here. Then I saw the title of the song. I was like, ah, let me first listen to this song. So I had the chorus of our song. Started. So I was like, I, I, I felt so bad. Then I told Sidaras, so you know what, let's first leave because I, 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 I had the anger, the anger in me. Actually, at this moment, let's try to reach Brendan Nambi via the cell phone and see if she picks up to comment on Smash and Sidaras' claims that probably she stole their song, Party Started. So I'm dialing Brendan Nambi right now. And I'm actually going to put her on loudspeaker. It's ringing. Hi, dear. Hello. How are you, Brenda? Yes. It's Precious here. Yes, Precious. Okay. I, I don't really know what to say. Hmm. Because I'm, I... I absolutely, like I said, I told you I don't know who those people are. Mm -hmm. And I don't know where they're getting their stories from. Okay. But from my such, I understand their song and my song, have, they, they have the same title. Mm. So I do not know if they actually own the words, get the party started. Mm -hmm. Because I do not know that those words belong to a certain, a particular person or people. Okay. It just so happened that I think their song is, 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 has the same title as mine. Mm. But I don't think it's fair for them to just get up and say that I stole their song. Did you two probably try to contact Brenda and talk to her about it? No, actually, I haven't contacted her as yet. Yeah, we, we, we don't know where she is. We don't know. We don't know where she is. Because imagine you go and do someone's song, then even you don't tell someone about that. So. 
how do you expect me to I, I don't know anything about Brenda by the way no, I don't like you might not know anything about yeah. Brenda but probably if it is your song and you say it's your song yeah. you could try and get her number call her up and tell her you know what you've been producing your music with Nash and he gave you a song me probably that is what I think uh, you guys should have done for me I thought like I'm um, coming here she will, she will realize and she will come and talk to us Okay. Yeah. I, I asked them why they couldn't have reached you or try to call you and ask you before they came to the media. And they said they want the media to know first and then probably you'll give them a call and see what to do about the whole issue. Exactly. That's what I'm saying. If, if someone steals from you, why don't they actually go to the police? Because when someone steals from you, you go to the police or you call those people. Okay. You so. Go to the media. So what are you going to do now? The other time you said you are going to to involve manager, your lawyer. My manager, my manager called their lawyer. Mm -hmm. to tell them mm -hmm. if if they if they insist that I did uh, I, I stole their song like they say, then they'll have to contact their lawyer, my lawyer. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because I, I I do not know those people. I don't know how they look like. No, why would I steal someone else's concept? Okay, so can they can they actually confess that they would have pulled off that concept? Okay. Yeah. Now at the same time you're telling me, in the version you've seen of Party Started with yeah. Brenda, there's also uh, it's also featuring Big Trio and yeah. DJ Mosh. Yeah. So you're saying producer Nash was working with Brenda, not with Big Trio or oh. DJ Mosh. So you're saying it's Brenda who probably asked Big Trill and DJ Mosh to yeah, be featured in the song? Yeah, she's the main character in the, in the song. Yeah. That was just featured in yeah. Brenda's song. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Because so, I've never seen even uh, I've never seen Mosh or, or Big Trill at the studio. I've never seen them there. Okay. But I've seen Brenda there. Okay. So how does your song go? We got the party started, party guys wanna rock up the club. We got the music playing, party people get on the floor. We got the party, just started, started. We got the party, just started, all night long. Yeah. Okay, that sounds good. So you're saying that's exactly the other version of what they did. Mm -hmm. They got what the concept. The concept. Um, they got our concept. Then they do. The, this, there's a there's a part in the in the song. Yeah. Goes. Every party, party. Every party, party. Come get a party. Come, Come get, get a party. party. Straight to, to the, the party. party. Straight to the party. Now that's where they duplicated. Then yeah. They put the, the, exactly. their chorus. The way yeah. You listen to it. You, you get listen to it. it. He says this. He says something like party Let's started. Party, party started. started. Let's get this that's party started. Something like that. Mm. Yeah. Okay. Now you were also telling me that you already had your concept of how your music video would yeah, turn yeah, out yeah, like. Yeah. So and you're saying at the same time I that know, they when, also uh, when we did that song, yeah. The producer was just, I don't know, he was just too excited when he did yeah, it. it. was like, And he was like, man, we have to do this video right now. Yeah, so what, it was let, like, let's give it time. So yeah. he was like, okay, let's plan up, up the video, then we we'll see what to do about it. Then we laid down the storyboard of the, how the video would be. But, uh, well, but let's reserve this for the time when I have a breakthrough, like, let go, you get. So, I don't know, for, for me, just got everything, then gave it away, just like that. They are saying that the chorus is exactly the same, and I hear even the video that you did, they already had the storyboard of that exact video, so they are saying okay. it's the producer who who could have like given you their song. But how, how can I have the same concept of their video? <laughs> Seriously, I have this, that what, I walked into their mind, that the fact that you worked with that same producer, then... But, but, but the producer is not the one, the guy doesn't even know where because of the song song. Yeah, because I... I didn't know that song existed too when I asked you, when you actually called me too, and some, someone sent me a message on Facebook. I did not know those people exist. I did not know there's a song of that kind too when I called the producer and asked him where these people getting these things from. Actually... I wonder where I could get time to start thinking of that. Yeah. Why? What, Cause, what would be the reason cause why? Because sincerely, for us, we don't like uh, conflicts. We don't. We are not into that. So as I expect Brenda to say that, to say like maybe I don't know those people. I don't know anything about them. But then for us, as artists, we have to come out and talk uh, for ourselves. Mm. Yeah. So like I expect that because obviously she has a bigger name than us. So mm -hmm. I expect something like that. But then time will tell, because 
if you can do something like that, then we expect something even better than that after. So mm -hmm. maybe time will tell what she will bring after. I don't understand those boys. I don't even know who they are, first of all. I, I haven't uh, even heard their song. Yeah, My producer are. has not heard their song. They Rich are. has not heard their song. Brenda has not heard their song. Why would we copy their song? Apparently, I even talked to the producer. His name is Nat, what's his name, Mason. Mm. Even, even the producer said the songs are nothing alike. The only thing that they have is one similar sentence, which says, get the party started. Yeah, because so actually, actually, I called the producer to also try and get an interview from him, like to hear his side of the story, because they continue to emphasize that it must have been the producer who gave their song to Brenda. And he, he actually turned up here at the studio, but he refused to do, like to give us an interview on Pandora. So I just let it be. And then that's when I tried to reach Brenda for a, a bite about that. I, I told their manager, those, the manager, I told them to bring me the song. Mm. And they can't, even, they can't even bring me the song, so I don't even know what they're talking about. I don't even know if they have a song.